yes good afternoon my people today i'm going to show you how to solve this particular equation this is a, a simultaneous equation but you have to put it in order that will be suitable for solving simultaneous equation then let's follow me and see how we can solve this particular simultaneous equation but don't forget to subscribe to this video for always to, for us to always upload more video new videos for you people thank you so much uh, the first thing to do is to pick this first equation and simplify it so as to have uh, a, a particular equation that will be good for solving simultaneous equation. Drop it and pick the next one, next set of equation. Simplify it also and have a perfect equation that will be good for solving simultaneous equation so as to have a comprehensive equations that will be good for solving uh, simultaneous equation. What I mean is to this is solution solution the first thing is to pick this particular equation that says 2 all over 3 open bracket a minus 6 close bracket is equals to m minus 3 then i need to multiply all through by 3 so as to clear this fraction multiplying all through by 3 means this time 2 all over 3 open bracket a minus 6 everything will be multiplied by 3 then m will be multiplied by 3 then 3 will be multiplied by 3 that means by multiplying everything here by 3 means this 3 will cancel the 3 that means this will be multiplied by 3 this will be multiplied by 3 and this will be multiplied by 3 multiplying this one by 3 means this 3 will cancel this 3 so i will have 2 open bracket a minus don't mind me a my a resemble 9 6 close bracket is equals to m times 3 is 3 m minus 3 times 3 is 9 3 minus 3 times 3 is 9 then these two will have to open the bracket the relationship between 2 and the bracket is multiplication so 2a 2 times a is 2a minus this negative sign 2 times 6 is 12 is equals to 3m minus 9 then arriving at this stage we are now going to rearrange we are now going to collect like times don't forget i'm going to make more videos more and more videos on rearranging on collecting like terms so we need to collect like terms collecting like terms means 2a i don't have any other term in a then i have other variable which is 3m negative is equals to minus 9 plus 12 minus 9 plus 12 then the next thing i will say 2a minus 3 m is equals to minus 9 plus 12 is the same thing as 12 minus 9 which is the same thing as 3 and this is my first equation this is my first this is my first equation then i will now pick the second equation and simplify it so as to get something like this in this form so for us to have a simplified equation of this we need to write it down 3 all over 5 open bracket a plus 2 close bracket is equals to 2m plus 1 then just the way we did here we are now going to do it here we are going to multiply each individual term by 5 because 5 here is the LCM as far as this equation is concerned. So multiplying each individual term by 5 means to do the same thing we did here. So we are likely to have 3 open bracket A plus 2 close bracket is equals to 2 times 5. This is 10M plus 5. So just the way we did here we are now going to open the bracket for us to have uh, something like this 3 times a is 3a plus 3 times 2 is 6 is equals to 10m plus 5 very easy there is nothing difficult here 
So what I will do is still rearrange. Pick those terms in A, pick those terms in M, and pick those terms in constant. I mean, I have 3A minus 10M is equal to 5 minus 6. 3A minus 10 m is equals to 5 minus 6 is minus 1 this is my second equation this is my second equation what will i do next is to rearrange a comprehensive set of simultaneous equation i can call this one equation 1 this is 3a minus 10 m it's equals to minus 1. I can call this one my equation 2. Thank you, my people, for watching this video. This is all I have for you for today. You can go and check my previous videos on how to solve simultaneous equation using substitution or elimination method to solve this particular equation. Thank you so much. Next time. Bye.